Isn't this beautiful? The lava flow becomes the hair of the lady of the Donna Fugata. Where are we? Come find out with me. Sul Vulcano means on the volcano, and that's Donna Fugata on the Mount Tetna. The black lava flow that you see over there is one of the first stratas, like a thousand years old strata soil from one of the biggest eruptions this volcano saw. Then 1614, 1624, they had the two massive eruptions creating the, the, the bed uh, of today's vineyards in the Mount Etna. Despite the volcano is 3,000 meters above the sea level, so you have snow cap, you can ski in the morning and go into the beautiful ocean in the afternoon, same day. So, although it's 3,000 meters, 700 and 750 meters is where these vineyards are located on the northern side. Mount Tetna is a special, uh, geographically speaking, and the habitat is unique. The soil is special, the volcano is special, the seaside. So you are in Africa and yet you are a thousand meters above the sea level. What does it mean in terms of winemaking? Well, here, the Nerello Mascalese, and a little bit of Nerello Cappuccio every once in a while, these varieties are like Pinot Noir, or even the color could, if I didn't know what it was, could be Sangiovese or Nebbiolo. So the wines tend to be reactive, very um, mineral, lots of acidity, and salty bites. These are gastronomic wines, by the way. 21 hectares of uh, Donna Fugata on the volcano, divided, split in six different districts. A district in the Mount Etna is called Contrada. This winery makes a couple of crews and also this wine sul Vulcano, which I think is an incredible, surprising uh, a red that combines the smokiness together with the strawberry jam, very delicate, a little bit of floral touch in the wine, like a, almost like jasmine, if you will. And a gunflinty trace over there, a little bit of a, a pomegranate. Pomegranate. Mm. Here we only taste good stuff. So I'm happy actually to drink this wine. And I just back up exactly what I said. Light in terms of lightness and yet intense. Transparent color, transparent flavors, but lots of length. You can see how much saliva this wine would make you produce. So you want some fattier food, I think the mushrooms, sauté mushrooms, risotto mushroom, the mountain actually can release incredible mushrooms that I've tried that I've never tasted anywhere else in the world. But make no mistake, of course, you know, um, eggplant every, every time that I'm in Sicily, but a little bit of fish too. This wine can actually go well with fish. Have you watched our next video yet? Go for it, guys. And for more tips, tricks, and love, follow our social media, subscribe our channel, and we'll catch up with you later.